Hey guys, welcome to our YouTube channel. Today we are going to solve our skill track daily challenge using Python programming language. Before going to logic, if you didn't subscribe to our channel, then subscribe right now and make our work more meaningful. First, we'll understand our question. The program has to accept the integer n and the n string values representing the relationship between the users on social media. There are two ways to indicate relationship. So the first way is from A to B, that is user A follows user B and B to A, that is user B follows user A. The program must print all the users with the number of followers in alphabetical order as the output. Now we will take our first test case. So in this test case, we have five relationships that is n is equal to five and then we have A to C, then M to C, and then A to V, and C to M, and then H to M. So we have to find the count of each alphabet, and we have to print all the users with number of followers in alphabetical order. So the alphabets present in this test case are A, C, H, M and V. So these are the alphabets present here. So first we have A to C. So at that time C will be incremented by 1. That is the count of C becomes 1. So we can write that from 0, C would become 1. So initially, all will be in 0. And then, M is equal to 0. And V is also 0. So when we have A to C, C will be incremented by 1 and then we have M to C. So C will be again incremented, it becomes 2 and then we have A to V. So V will be changed to 1 and then we have C to M. So M will be change to 1 and then we have H2M again M will be changed to 2. So now we have got the count for each so these are the count for each alphabet and the relationships and this will be our output. Now let us implement our program. First we will get the integer n as the input and then we will have the empty list called user list and one more empty list called follower list. where we are going to store the relationships and then now we have to iterate over so for that we have a for loop for ctr in range of n we have the string value equal to input of dot strip of so after getting the string value if the 
reaching value of 2 is s of 2 is equal to equal to greater than means then the follower list will be appended with the string value minus 1 and then in the else part we'll have the followers list will be appended with s of 0 and then the users list will be appended with s of 0 and then user list will be appended with s of 1. That is minus 1. And then we have user list is equal to the sorter of the set of user list so as we have to sort them in alphabetical order we have this statement and then for val in range that is sorry the val in user list we have to print the val and use end argument and at last we have to print the followers list dot count of the van there is each character as the output here it is string val Now let us run our program, we will pass our first test case. So yes, we have got the correct output. And now we will run our second test case. So here also we have got the correct output. Our program has passed all our given test cases successfully. Hope you guys understand. Thanks for watching. See you next video.